Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. A couple weeks ago I made a video and I spoke about what I felt was going to happen with ammo. I think the prices are going to skyrocket. I think it's going to make our previous ammo shortage, which I called the crisis, look lightweight compared to what to expect in the future. And my reasoning for this is because of raw materials and the price of raw materials has skyrocketed along with everything else. Everything that you buy has an increased price. Inflation is taking its toll on everything. You look at the price of food. It, consider this, when you go into a restaurant, you may notice they have new menus. When a restaurant makes new menus, it's not because they're adding more items, perhaps so a little bit, but it's because they are increasing the prices. It costs an additional 40 bucks to fill up a tank of gas. Everything has gone up. To expect that not to happen with ammo is unrealistic. I don't think that that is a logical standpoint. When I made that video, a lot of people said, well, I went to so-and-so store and they were loaded with ammo. Yes, we are just seeing the end of the light, the light at the end of the tunnel, if you will. And I think it's going to get worse. For future supplies, every component it takes to make ammo is going to be increased. And then you're going to have scalping, you're going to have price gouging, and a whole host of other things that are going to really skyrocket. In my, it, I'm telling you, all we have to do is look at the trends. People were telling me, you're wrong, but the majority of the people said, you are right. And so I've gone into action because I really believe this is the case. So I, I've got some ammo. I've been picking up ammo on a regular basis. I check this stuff constantly. I try to find the best deals. I don't have an ammo sponsor. I know people saying, well, it must be nice. You go to the range all the time. Well, I, I don't have an ammo sponsor. I pay for my ammo just like everybody else. So I search for deals. Now I mentioned I picked up a uh, thousand rounds of steel case tool ammo, nine millimeter, 340 bucks from Ammunition Depot. They got the ammo to me right away, within three days, maybe four. You know, ammo uh, depot, Ammunition Depot, AIM Surplus, Target Sports, they are very quick with shipping and I appreciate that. Locally, I picked up some 38 Special, okay, these were reloads, 45 ACP. I'm running low on 45. So I also picked up a thousand rounds from LAX ammo. Now I also picked up, I'm sorry, 500 rounds, 500 rounds of 45. I also picked this up. Now this is nine millimeter. This is 500 rounds from LAX ammo. They give you this nice case. These are remanufactured loads from LAX ammo. I think I got a pretty good price, but the shipping took two weeks. I just received it. I placed the order March 27th. It took two weeks. So the 45 is not here yet. It'll be here on Monday, 500 rounds. I'm going to throw a picture in here of my receipt and you can see how much I paid for it. But that shipping, you know, I know ammo companies have been putting stuff on hold and everything, but I went to the range twice. I wanted to shoot 45. I didn't have enough to do what I wanted to do. So I... Didn't I didn't shoot 45 because I didn't have the ammo. I went into Cabela's. Uh, the big box stores are always a bit inflated, but I picked up another box of Winchester white box, 500 rounds. Right there, 500 rounds. Now, a while back, I picked this up for right around 170, you know, maybe 168, something like that. And I felt like it was fair, all things considered. But this cost $188. After tax, it was $202. We are already seeing increased prices of ammo. I picked up some 12 gauge. You don't need to see all the buy. You know, it's a box of 12 gauge. Big deal. Uh, the 45 was Fiocchi. So I am getting ammo constantly. And I want to continue training. I want to continue shooting. I want to continue making reviews. If you want to do that, I highly suggest that the ammo that you see on your shelves, that you pick up a box or two. You know, that's all you need to do. A box or two here, a box or two there, because I believe 
four, maybe three to six months, we are going to see ammo prices skyrocket. And we're going to see a whole host of other things. If you look at the trends of everything from housing to fuel to raw materials to food, everything has skyrocketed. It's not a good time for our economy. We went from one of the best economies to a sinking economy and it's sinking fast. And a lot of people said, well, you know, it's not going to affect ammo prices like you think. I disagree. I think it will affect ammo prices. I'm even going to head out to a place called Buffalo Bills in near Findlay, Ohio. I'm told they have a ton of ammo. I'm going to be heading out that way anyways. And hopefully I'll be able to, you know, take a couple hundred bucks and buy some more ammo because it's going to become scarce. It's going to become more and more expensive. It never dropped to the price that we once got it for. Perhaps in the future one day, but we're not going to see it in the near future. And if you enjoy shooting as much as I do, then I highly suggest that you pick up ammo. Now, the real wise people, like the, the, the very smart people, <laughs> they are the ones who said, you know, I saw this coming. I started buying two, three boxes every time I got paid. I've got thousands of rounds. I'm not worried about it. Those guys are bright. I have that to a degree. I think compared to a lot of people, they would think I have a ton of ammo, but I have a bunch of different caliber handguns that I need to feed, and that can be a lot of ammo that needs to be stored and taken care of and everything else, and I do that. But some of the other calibers, 9mm, 45 primarily, I have enough 40, I have a lot of uh, 5.56 and 223 and things like that, but there are still, like 38 Special is hard. 357, near impossible, 22 Magnum, near impossible, some of the hunting loads, very hard to find. So if you see it, I highly suggest that you get it because I truly believe the price of ammo is going to continue up. I don't care what you're seeing in your store now. Whew. Cold day outside, I just got in. But what you're seeing at your store now, I believe is temporary. It was getting more plentiful, and now it's going to, this is just me talking, but if you look at the trends of everything else, it's going to be hard to find, and that is why I continue to shop for ammo. I continue to search every day because I think it's the right thing to do. It's no different than prepping for anything else. You want an adequate supply just in case, and I truly believe with all my heart that just in case is coming really soon. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.